Pax Nation, and welcome back to some more Creative Verse. Hope you guys are having a great day. Make sure you do YouTube stuff, hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Join the Discord link in the description while you're down there. Leave a comment, and also if you're feeling super generous, you can drop a super thanks and show your love. But everything you do is greatly appreciated, including watching. But you know the like button's right there. Hey, we got an employee. Check it out. Got an employee. Hey, I got no game sound. I do now. What's up, employee? Alright, you make sure that hooks the thing. You got it. Good, you do your thing. Okay. So, we gotta do some more detailing work, right? Like, there's just a couple things that still need to be done. Like, down under here, this still has to be done. We might as well get this done, right? What is this, canvas wall? I don't have that on me anymore. Canva. Canvas. I don't need you on me anymore. And grab that, which is just a gray. And let's just work on the floor real quick. Which I don't have to do it the normal way. I can do it easier way. So, this may sound like a broken record. Because it kind of is. I was just messing around on my Xbox the other day. And I was looking at the uh, Xbox Game Pass or rewards with Xbox thing where you can earn like L. Ooh, right. Where you can earn, like, uh, rewards and get Microsoft credit. You know, you can get, like, 10 bucks or whatever. I was just checking that stuff out, wondering, like, how viable is it, you know? Like, is it worth doing and all that? And it is, because I already grabbed 10 bucks off. At, well, 10 bucks. Really, really fast, and I'm already so close to another 10 bucks. That it definitely is worth it, especially if you have Game Pass, because Game Pass, they give you so many more options to earn. And you get to play fun games, which we'll get into here in a second. But I was uh, on there, and I noticed him say something about Resident Evil. I was like, ooh, what Resident Evil game do they want me to play to earn a little bit of extra bonus points? I'm up for that. It wasn't. It was the Netflix show. I think you could tell by my reaction and not enthusiasm how it went. <laughs> I was like, oh, cool, a Netflix show. I remember hearing about that. I had no idea it was this close to being released. I had no idea when it was going to be released, but I thought it was like next year. But I was like, cool, I'll give that a watch. Well, I watched one and a half episodes. I don't know why people can't make good Resident Evil live action content. Well, that's, that's, that's unfair. You know, the original six Resident Evil movies had their own charm to them. You know, they were different. They were doing their own thing, but they had their own little charm to them. They were trying to insert an original character into things, which, you know, we see in media all the time. Like, if you have a video game about an anime or whatever, and it's a video game, they're most... Oh, I did put stairs in here. Okay. They're most likely going to have, like, an original character to introduce in the story that you may play as. And it's just their way of getting you involved in the story. And that's the same way they did with Resident Evil. They created their own character to kind of give their own individuality to the series. But, you know, I watched... Uh, I don't know if I watched all of them, but... I watched a good amount of those movies. I used to, like... Be excited for him, but then I kind of fell off like I did with Saw. I still haven't seen the original Saw or the new Jigsaw or Spiral, whatever it's called. Spiral. It's called Spiral. I still haven't seen that. But anyway, back to the point of the Resident Evil Netflix adaptation. Best part about it. At first, I didn't like it. At first, I really, really was like interested. I was, I was interested at first, right? I'm like watching. I go, oh, okay. It's taking place in England. I was like, okay, this is, uh, different, okay. And then they talked about, like, timelines and stuff like that, of what happened, and I'm thinking, like, okay, they're really going their own telling. It's like, oh, well, you know that? That's smart. You put the movie, uh, show into a time frame, into a location that Resident Evil games haven't been to yet, or 
did six go to England? I don't remember six very well. I remember very few bits and pieces of six. But anyway, I was like, oh, that's really cool. Like, kind of doing it like that way. Modern day England. I was like, I can get behind this. Well, a little bit more futuristic, I would say. Because, you know, it's got to be Umbrella Corp. It's got to have all that stuff in it. But right out the gate, first, I don't know, five, ten minutes, they bring a character in who is the main staple of the character or show, and she instantly brings race into the thing. And I don't have time for racist. I don't. And you know what? You can be a racist. It, it, you know, it's... Um, I don't know. I don't want to. Yeah, it's 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 a difficult subject to talk about, of course, sensitive subject. But I just don't have time for them, and I don't believe the definition of racism is white versus black. I think a lot of people think that, but I definitely don't believe that. And this girl, forgot her name, or I would say her name. I think it's Anne, or the sister is Anne. I don't remember. She instantly goes. Did you notice how there's only five black people in this neighborhood? Why is that a thing? Why did that need to be said? Like, that is so bad. As long as things like that are happening, it being said, it's like, you're never going to get rid of racism. You're fighting to get rid of racism, but yeah, you're saying racist things like that. And I, I hate it. I hated it so much. It it definitely was like, I was like, ugh, that's, ugh, no, ugh, I don't like, I don't like it all. And then... What you doing, employee? Good work. Uh, I kind of want to put something up here, but I also like it flat. I was going to actually make an entrance up to the top here, but then I'd have to put something up there, but I like it flat. So I'm not going to put anything up there. So anyway, I was like, oh, that's horrible. And then it took me a second. I know they said it a couple times and I missed it. But I heard them say... Wesker. I was like, wait. Jeez, don't scare me. Stupid truck. I was like, Wesker? Albert Wesker? Ooh, stone door looks pretty good. Industrial door? Ah, oh, terrible. Stone door might make a lot of sense with this place. More than an iron door. Let's go stone. I was like, oh, okay. They changed Wesker completely, which, uh, how does that look? It's more, stop it. It's more about the outside look than it is the inside look. Oh, that's fine. Uh, you know what? Contrast in color? I like it. So I was like, oh, okay. A little different. That's, that's fine. Is what it is. But there's people have joined the world. Loti Doti Bear. Interesting name. So I was like, okay, that's fine. You know, Wesker, it's, it's their own telling, right? I'll be, I'll be calm about it. I won't freak out over the fact that they changed Wesker completely. And I'll have to say, best part of the show. I only watch one and a half episodes, and that's all I'm ever going to watch. And it's a. Uh, it was really good. And I'll have to say, that that actor, spot on. Oh, that actor was so good. I don't know if Wesker becomes more of what we know Wesker to be later on in the show, or if they planned him to be 10 seasons down the road to be the Wesker we know. But holy crap. The scene where he had to go to the school, and he sat down and basically got his daughter out of trouble, was so good. So well delivered. It was so spine tingling. Like, that is what Wesker should be. That was so good. But that was only four or five minutes of a 50 minute episode that was good. Kind of sucked. You know? It was also very horribly done. <laughs> but 
But anyway, yeah, I, I could ramble on and on and on about how bad it is, but I watched one and a half episodes, and I was like, oh, bye. And I was like, yeah, I can't. I can't. No, I, I'm not going to waste my time on something that's a garbage Resident, Resident Evil take. I can't do it. I, I don't, I'm trying to think what to do here, by the way. I was like, I can't do it. I, I just, no. Don't we have, like, something futuristic, maybe? It's called sci-fi. Yeah. Let's get some galactic terms in here. Uh, beep, 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 whoa. Okay. Well, we'll do something like, oh, how you doing? Stop it. Yeah, we'll do something like that. And then a big one here. Take back my canvas wall. Again, very contrasty. I like it. So it's like, beep, 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 beep. This is how you drive. This is how you do something. We got to have a communication table. Stop it. Got to have a communication table over here. We can kind of bring this bend around, I guess. Kind of fill this in. So like a little communication area over here. Maybe take this one away. Take that one over here like that. And then take something like that one, that one. And do that and like this. Stop. I got you. So I gave up on it. I gave up on that show. I was like, nope, I'm good. I am good. Uh, that's good. I like that. I like that for a simple area of, of uh, like your, you know, captain's area where you're here. You're making sure things going good. A chair would be nice, but I'd want to center the chair between these two, and I can't do that. So I'm just gonna leave a no chair. Very simplistic. Not a whole lot of, what was that? Not a whole lot of detail really yet. I don't know, I gotta think. We could put the one eighth. The eighth on top and make it, oh yeah. Okay, yeah, we can do that. We can grab that eighth. All right, so I need to go after you. I need to go to Khan. I need to grab this. So, what, should it be blue or should it be the black? Or the gray? Maybe it should be this? Yeah, I think that is the gray. Because then I could do this. Kind of give the area a little bit more detail. Oop. You know? You know, that kind of looks like, the, that's a little bit more detail. I'm okay with this. Hmm, I don't know what else to put on there. I do want to put more stuff in here. We do need lights. We do need some type of lighting situation here. Light. So I uh, gave up on that show, like I was saying. I couldn't deal with it. It was just, it's it's too, it was too bad. It was, it was just horrible. I hated it. So I decided not to frustrate myself with it. Instead, I finished up uh, Future Diary. Holy crap. Oh, that's what I meant to talk about in Discord. I'll get to that. Holy crap. Did that show get crazy? Ooh. Nah. I think... Do we don't really want to go luxurious? We've got to go industrial, I guess. So industrial lights. Man, I want better light options. Can we have more light options, please? Ooh. Galaxy. It'd be nice to have more light options. I mean, you you have been giving us light options, although this game has got nothing for updates. Hello? Why do why lights not turn on anymore? Oh. You are turned on. Oh, hang on. Let there be light. I forgot if you paint them. <laughs> I didn't even notice they were painted. All right, so let's uh, let's be a little. No, although that's kind of cool. More about that one, and then on this path over here. Here, did I leave a gap? I did. I did. I did. 
And then we'll go like here and here. And then above the door. Ugh. I would like it above the door. We'll have like a... Oh, it would have been nice there, but nope. We'll have up here. A little bit of light action there to signal that, you know, things could happen and things might happen and you gotta watch out. All right. Other than that, that's that's uh, that's that's the cockpit. That's nice. But holy crap! Did Future Diary get insane towards the end, and then it got ridiculous, but it was still fun. And then it got sad, and then it ended, and then didn't. <laughs> it was it was something. Uh, let's let's throw some more lights up here just to have like we need deck lights, you know. Uh, technically, that will never have to touch this last panel, so that's fine. And I kind of like them orange. It's kind of like a, ooh, there's an orange light coming. I like it. Yeah, I think that's enough lights on the side. That, that should be fine. Oh, if that was one solid block, that would be perfect. How's yours? Nope. All right. Uh, I think we're good. This can go, by the way. So that was really cool. I liked it a lot. I don't know what I'm going to watch next. Although there was something. I was watching off of Hulu. Future Diary, that is. And it, it just did like a, here, watch this next type thing. You know, just like autoplay. And it, I can't remember the name of the anime it was like hey watch this next if you like future diary you'll like this and it looked interesting it looked like it was murder mystery like a bunch of kids have to deal with a mystery and murder with their friends or something like that it looked pretty cool and i was gonna check that out but i haven't yet uh we're gonna need some type of light situation in here if this wasn't even i could do it Ooh, the light bar. Or that bar. Yeah. Uh, I shouldn't need the door anymore. Boom, boom. There we go. Oh, illumination. And it helps guide the crates back into their spot. But, um, yeah. Ooh, ooh, I can't, I can technically there, and I will. I definitely will, and I could do that, but that doesn't look good. What if I did that? Am I putting them there? No, I have not. I've been putting them up one. If I did that and that, it's a little extra light here on the dock. Or poop deck. Oh, I was going to talk about something else. Oh, the Game Pass thing. Yeah, like to earn points. And this month they wanted me to play, or week, or this week. This week they wanted me to play uh, Search and Destroy. Didn't play it. I just loaded up the game and it counted. But <laughs> they also wanted me to play uh, One Piece. Mm, the back is too flat for me. We got to think about that. They want me to play One Piece Pirate Warrior 4. It's part of Game Pass. Every game they ask you to play there is a part of Game Pass, so it's nice and easy. And I already got Game Pass, so I can get free points. So I was like, okay, cool. I'll give that a shot. And I was like, I kind of want to play it. Not just not just load it up and get the points, but I actually want to play it. So I started to play it. And holy crap, is it fun. If I did like this, oh yeah. That got some illumination. But you know what? Instead of that, let's do there and wrong. In there. Oh yeah, that got some illumination in there. But it's really, really fun. It's a uh, Dynasty Warriors S game, or um, what's the Nintendo one they do? They just did. Um, I think it's actually a Warrior. Like they did Hyrule Warriors and the Dragon Quest Warrior one, and they just recently did the. Uh, uh, Fire Emblem Warrior 1 or something like that, whatever it's called. I wanted 
the paintings. Like those. So if I enter pick uh, I can okay. We can add a little little artwork to the thing. Let's go. We've got some code coming in. That's new by the way. Or at least it's new since the last time I was on here looking at things. Okay. Ooh, that's kinda cool. I like that one. I'll put that one up. Just as a, I mean, honestly, like a map would be cool, but I don't know if we can do that. Maybe a double one to give a little, a little add something to something. Oh, that's cool. That's super cool. You wouldn't so happen to have a map, would you? Ooh. Man, people build way better than I do. Way better than I do. Look at that. That's so cool. Oh, that is so cool. Ah, things happened. Where am I? Burger. Ooh, I've seen that. Look at the boat. Oh, that one's better. That's more high res. Look at the windmill. That windmill's way better than mine. Alright, high res. I love this game. Smile. Let's join the world. Nice. Alright, a little bit extra, uh, you know. Oh. Hide. Doesn't see me. No, that's my light on. There's no idea I'm here. We're hiding. But anyway, the game's really fun. One Piece. Really, really cool. My only complaint is because Chimas don't pop on it. There he is. He's moving. He's on the move. He doesn't know where I am. He doesn't have a compass. Only I have a compass. Boo. <laughs> anyway. Uh, back end here. This is kind of boring. But what could I do? See, I did something like that. Did something like that over here. It's kind of like an engine, right? So maybe... Kind of do something like that here. I'll keep it white for now. That's a one, two, three. One, two, three. Put it there. So, what if we did something like this? It's kind of give it some texture, some backness to it. Oops. Uh, copy. Rotation. Mm, copy. Which I just, just not no color. But if I gave it a little bit of a butt, like that, just that little bit is super helpful. Maybe go up one more row. I don't know, how does two thickness look? Maybe, maybe, maybe like drop it down like that maybe I, I kind of like the one more than I like the three or the two yeah so let's try something like this oops and, give me and then mm, yeah like that's better I like the one so we did something like that and like this is the engine coming out, right? Like ba boom, coming down. And then I still haven't done the bottom yet. 
But like that could be the beginning work of the of the back. You know, da da da. And then maybe Yeah, maybe one more. Maybe one more row. Kinda give it a like a giant engine thing. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm winging it. And like that's its big engine butt. Sure, I can go with that. Big giant engine butt. Listen, thank you for respecting my build. Even though I know you could, I don't know if you, you know you don't got build permission. Alright, uh, front end. Front end looks cool. I like the front end. I'm happy with the front end. Happy with the windows. Happy with all that. This all works for me. Alright. We can uh, go back down, I guess, and... Work on the lighting? Maybe... I kind of like the idea of like putting these on the ceiling. You know, like, this is bright. This, like, makes it light, you know? So, what if I did... Here. And we wait till it gets a little dark. Throw it here. A little dark. Something like this. This would be nice. Yeah, yeah, throw some shadow still, but it illuminates the entire thing. Like, that is super good. And then in between windows, we can stack up, like, chest. They're probably not going to have anything in them, but we can stack up chest. So we can stack up, like, I'd rather stack up these, I think. I think these will look the best. And they look the most stackable. And these are like uh, people's cargo, and I'm not on anything. So if I did something like this, this, this. Yeah, but if I did that, then it's floaty. Hmm. But if I did. Ooh, I couldn't really put anything there because it takes the block. Ha, huh, how would I do this? wonder if I did this, then if I put something here and I could do there, I would take the entire block, so I wouldn't have to do that either. Ooh, okay. If only I could take this, put it on a shelf. Technically, I can. Technically, I could take this, throw this up here, interact with it, put a chest on there. But the problem is, it do tank chest. And let's uh, let's do this so I can see. And if I put it there, it's there. If I put it there, it's there. You know, it's it definitely doesn't have the ability to make it a big boy chest. Like if I could have that full size chest up on a shelf, I would do it. But I can't. So, what if I stack them? Hi. That's not the one I wanted. That gives me sort of what I want. Actually, that's a kind of a. It's kind of a cool look. Because they're both interactable. Like, if I was playing survival or something, this would work. Because then you could also do that, and, like, that, oh. that's kind of cool. Blech. You know? I mean, it's not very, oh, it is accessible. You could just aim. It's kind of cool. But if I do something like this... They're floaty. And I don't really like it too much. 
Where'd it go? What happened? There we go. Not a big fan of that, but that's kind of cool. I do like that. No idea what that person is doing. I have no idea who that person is. They're not talking, so it's all right. Just chill, adventure around, have fun. Mm. So... And I would... It would... Uh, it doesn't make sense, so it doesn't make sense. Huh. I don't know how I'm gonna do a crate. That's cool, though. That's, like, a really awesome thing to do for survival. It looks cool, too. Like, I really like the look of that. What's the other side look like? Well, that's even cool. Gimme. Huh. How are we gonna do storage? I mean, I could just do, like, basic boring storage line there, but then that's, like, Man. But I also said these were going to be kind of. What? Oh, whoops. Storage. Get rid of that one. Did we not in the Western one? The Western. Did we get a box? We did get boxes. Well, box ish. I could treat this as a box. And did we get an actual box, though? No. So what I could do instead... Let's go like this. Kind of make boxes. And kind of make it look like... Maybe... You know, we've got... Stuff being delivered. And these are your Amazon packages. <laughs> and I could do stuff like that. Just chuck it around. Which sounds like a plan. Yeah, I mean, it helps fill. And then I think I'll leave, like, the windows alone. Try to do something like, well, why would you put that there if you could put that there, you know? Try to do a little different for each one. It's probably not going to happen. And then this one's just like that, maybe a couple, you know, things like that. And like this one, just, uh, just, just a row because it's too annoying to go through. Maybe a little bit of a, a little bit of a break up there. Yeah. Something like that. You know, just, just chucking boxes as you do. No rhyme or reason. Just, just throwing down boxes. Bye. <laughs> Han, you were like right here. You were like right here. He <laughs> I think you were there. You were either there or you're here. You're either in there or you're right here. Either one. You're there somewhere. So yeah, we won't finish up this up. We'll finish this up next time. But yeah, I, I really enjoyed playing a Dynasty Warriors type game. I haven't played a Dynasty Warriors type game in forever. Other than that, really haven't been up to much. I finished a project for my hobbies channel. I haven't posted anything about that yet or haven't even edited it or not. Freaking Digimon's taking forever to come out. <laughs> Not just that, it's kind of annoying that the Digimon game, Digimon Survive that is, which has so much hype in it for me. Holy crap, does it sound so good and so interesting. And the developers of the game asked people not to spoil anything from chapter 5 on which has got me intrigued like what happens to chapter 5 what happens to chapter 5 on like what what's happening I am so curious that's good for now until we get rid of this box eh, I can do this one actually a little something like that yeah that's good yeah like what happens and I need those other way 
and I'm very curious. But the problem is, the game. Oh, this actually looks really good. The game is not up for preload anywhere, pre-order online anywhere. You can pre-order a physical copy, but you can't pre-order a digital copy right now. And I'm not the only one because I looked it up last night, and people are having the same issue. But they're not available anywhere. Uh, I know what? Those boxes look nice. Yeah, it's like people are complaining that they can't find it. It's not available for pre-order. And then some people said, well, this is Bandai Nako's thing. You know, this is what they do. They do this. They don't always put things out for pre-order. They'll just drop it on the day it releases. Which is, yeah, it's, it's okay, but I really wanted to preload the game just so I know the release date. I mean, I know it's out because there's a content creator that I sometimes watch. I subscribe, but I don't watch all the time. He uh, is already playing the game and already got a couple episodes. By now, probably a couple episodes out. Maybe a few episodes by now. And, uh, yeah, but he most likely, what he does is I know he has an account on his on his, I know for his Switch, he's got an account. He probably has one for every console and everything he has of a Japan, a Japanese account. So he'll grab games from Japan. And in Japan, the game comes out a day earlier than it does for everyone else in the world. So he probably just did it that way. He's probably playing it in English, but he just downloaded the game off of a Japan server. Where are you going, employee? You've been getting away that easy. Back to work. I don't think he can ever leave. As long as I don't ever give him a ability to get down from here, I don't think he can leave. He probably no. How you you had to spawn? He had to spawn up here. Employee, there you are. Think you can hide from me? I can fly. But anyway, pretty sure I didn't talk about all the stuff I wanted to talk about. Most likely didn't happen, as per usual. But oh. Did you poop out a baby? Ma'am? Ma'am? Ma'am, did you poop out a baby? There he is. Hey, we're getting there. I don't know how much more we're going to do to this thing before I have to call it done. And I might just be calling it done. I might just finish off that. Oh, we got to do the bottom. Never mind. We're not done. We got the annoying bottom next episode. That might be done after that. Who can knows? Whoosh. Whoosh. I like it. I like the Hippo Express. It's got your big crates for your big orders. It's got the small crates for your small orders. And it's got imprisonment. What more can you ask for? <gasps> a prison boat. A prison! Oh, we need a prison. Oh, we need a prison. We're gonna burn we're gonna put a prison. Where are we going to put a prison? Right here. So they dream of escape because they see the boats coming in. Okay. Sign. 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 Wood. Sign. Wood. Sign. Sign. Wood. 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 Sign. Sign. Prison. Got it. That's going to be fun. I built a jail, didn't I? Yeah, I built a jail already in this game. In whatever I called that village, that the bungalow village, whatever, I built out all the bungalow stuff. Yeah. But, what? Oh, I thought that was uh, another animal. But yeah, that'd be fun. Build a nice little industrial, or, uh, yeah, industrial prison in there. Have all the smoke that's like this, but facing inwards, too. You know, give them a, a little bit of smoke insulation and stuff like that, poison. Yeah, you know, you're gonna teach criminals a lesson. That'll be fun. That'll be the next project after we get down the boat. All right, but that's gonna do it for this episode. As per usual, I didn't get my point across or whatever I was trying to talk about. I don't remember anymore. I don't. I don't structure these. I just go. I have some other stuff in the work, I can say that, but not not ready to be talked about yet. I forgot about this little guy. I have a little a little cat demon thing of a resin pour that actually worked out and it has enough detail I didn't lose too much that I actually could paint this little guy up. Yeah, I forgot about that. 
But anyway, uh, yeah. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging on me. You know what? For those who stuck around to the end and who are not a part of the Discord, here's a little sneak peek at the upcoming video on the Hobbies channel. Here, we'll do this. Dun, 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 dun. Look at him. He's on like a nice base with snow and a rocky river. And I know it's hard because he's small. Camera doesn't focus very well. And it's... It's light colored, and I found out with this camera, it hates light colored stuff, like white, and this, it's more blue. It looks way more blue than it does on camera right now. Way more blue. It doesn't do it justice. The uh, footage I got, I think, I believe I got good footage on my phone. I'm not sure. I've got good pictures on my phone, at least, of how the color actually is on this thing. But he's really cool. I like him. That's a video coming to the Hobbies channel when I get around to editing it. Who knows when that's going to be. But that's going to do it for the episode. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with me. I hope you come back next episode and hang out with me. But until then, take it away, outro me. Thank you so much for watching that video. And if you liked it, make sure you give that video a like. And also comment down below. And while you're here, subscribe for more amazing content. And go check out another one of the gaming videos over on this side. And then you can click up there. Wait up there. Boop, boop. And you can subscribe. Or head over to my hobbies channel over here where you can watch me paint Optimus Prime, you know, the Transformer, more than meets the eye, over there. And also, subscribe by clicking up there. And until next time, I'm Apex Reaper. Y'all stay positive. Thanks for watching.